Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlemagne's adventure in Fragmented. Awesome. So, what are we doing today? Well, today we are gonna carry on. So, what I need to do is I need to harvest these plants here. We need to harvest a little bit of. Okay, why am I walking so slow? Oh, because I need to hit the shift. Okay, we need to process this plant. Uh, come on, why can't I target this thing? Did they change something? Used to be able to target these things. How about if we... Um, okay, that's interesting. How about if we go back to the axe? Ah, there we go. Now it's highlighting. Up here when I select this plant. So if we change back to the, the knife. There we go. I need a bunch of this fiber. So if you look at my inventory here. I cleaned it up a bit. I created these bags and threw everything into the pouches. Because I think everything... Let's see here. If I go into here... Yeah, see, it puts everything into the appropriate pouch, which is amazing. So that's a very neat little trick. So, for example, if I pound on these, the, the, I'm going to collect the fiber. There's the berries, the seeds, it looks like. Let's take a quick... Wow, that's a lot of, this is a big plant here. Okay, now if we take a peek in here, you'll notice it's just the berries here, which is awesome. Everything else goes into a container somewhere. And yeah, I don't know how much we have, but at least there's more storage capacity. And yeah, so it's no big deal having that extra axe now. And so basically the plan is to go and harvest uh, for some more animal fat, because that is definitely a must. I also need to harvest these things, these rocks, uh, both kinds of rocks. I need to harvest the big ones because the big ones give me stone, iron, limestone, and then, oh, what the heck is that? What is that? Set lag? That's new. Woo! Whoa! Wow. Yo, brah. I love how they just go through the rocks. Hello? So the aiming is kind of weird. When they're too close, it's it's kind of hard to shoot them. Uh, so that's kind of interesting. You might have to change the volume of the music. Kind of chopping the stuff up here. Lurker meat, set lang meat, so I might have something new. Yeah, we'll have new stuff, so we'll have to put some into the cloth pouch here. Maybe we'll throw that in there. We'll throw that in there as well, because we know what you can do with all that stuff. You can craft things. And it doesn't look like you can keep the food with you. It looks like there is a decay, because whenever you, I come back on, these things are gone so let's see yeah so there is decay time so I guess we have 20 minutes to work with that stuff otherwise it disappears yeah there's creatures here what's going on do we pick up animal fat there uh, what's the chat uh, does it say no no it doesn't say what we picked up okay that's okay uh, if I hit enter okay I don't remember these creatures being here last time we were here so they must have done some to a bunch of changes, I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm stuck on the, the bush. That's bull crap. Bull crap, man. Okay, so we got a shotgun. At least we don't lose anything, I don't think. Let's go Let's see where do we die. We need to head back in this direction. Those creatures are totally new. That's That never used to be that way. The last time we went through there, there wasn't nearly as bad as, as what we're experiencing right now, which is very interesting. Uh, let's see, where did I die? Oh, more north now. That's really interesting, because if you remember from the other videos... Yeah. Cool. So let's see here, let's carry... Where did we die? Where's my... Where's those corpses? Oh, we're almost there. Up here somewhere. I was on a tree. Let's see here. Where was I stuck on? I was stuck on something. 
Maybe you're stuck on this bush? Oh, there you are. Come on. Cool. These are like little dinosaurs. So, we're going to chop this guy up. Animal fat. Okay, so we're getting animal fat. So we'll just continue processing these creatures here. There's the, the ores and stuff here we need. So if we go back to this stuff. Everything's here, so it's not a big deal. It's not like you lose anything when you die. At least I don't think you lose anything. Let's go into our inventory. It's still level 9. I don't think I lost a level. And yeah, so I'm just going to kind of run around here. Going to do some basic harvesting. And yeah, and then I'll, I will return as soon as there's something interesting to discuss. Okay, so I did a little bit of harvesting. What did we collect? Uh, let's see here. I do need to make more bandages, I think. So we have a bunch of set laying meat, so we'll have to check that out. We also have, I've kind of harvested a bunch of materials a little bit. Got a little bit more logs, some more rhyolite. So I've got a bunch of materials in here. So now I'm going to head back. I think that's this way, is it? Yeah, that's this way. We're going to head back and we're going to see what we can build. Because I think that's the, the next thing to kind of check out. Uh, I find this game very grindy, unfortunately. So which means that... I'll have to play, record a bit, play, and then record kind of the style I've been doing. And hopefully you enjoy the style. I know I certainly do. I always enjoy the style that I produce because I always watch back the footage because I edit it. Uh, sometimes I edit, but I do watch back the whole thing just to make sure that it's good quality and, well, at least in my opinion, good quality. Doesn't mean it is, right? Because that's all subjective. It's all based on other people. You know, someone might think that, you know, like a large YouTuber that has a million subscribers has good content when the reality is, is, you know, in someone else's opinion, that's crappy quality, right? So it all depends what you feel is quality uh, content. Right? So, it's like many of you. How many of you are actually watching this part of the video, right? If, if you're watching still, comment down below. Otherwise, yeah. Otherwise, I won't see any comments, really. Right? And it doesn't count, Lushable. You know? not, not from you, because obviously, uh, I know, I think I know you're watching. At least I hope you are. If not, that's, not, that's no big deal either. <laughs> I play these games, this is how I do it. I record, and, and I talk about the games, and try and explore the game and see what it's all about as I discover and move along. So, since we have the forge here, let's go into our crafting. I might have to go into our skills. I just kind of want to quickly scan through here. So we can make food that we can feed ourselves with, but the berries are usually are enough. Uh, let's see here. What, what, what happens if we cook this stuff? We need sticks. So if we go craft, is there a life cycle on it? Uh, where is it? Oh, where's the lurker meat? Oh, it's it's hidden, hidden behind the recipes. <laughs> I don't see anything in there. Is there anything in here? 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 Oh, you know what? The I tried to do this, but we don't have a stove. So then let's actually build the stove. That's what we'll do. We shall build this, which we have. Everything looks like animal fat. Oh, man, we need more animal fat. We've got to kill more animals. Brutal. Let's craft that stove. And then let's also craft some ammunition, which we just passed by right here. We need. We have the forge, so we're okay. So let's do... How much does this create? 200... 300 shots. Okay, that should be good. It's actually very cheap to make these. Very easy to find these materials. The calibrite is like your metal. So we're going to have to, of course, harvest rocks. Going to have to harvest everything, really, is what the reality is. We have a wood fence here, which we could create to see what that looks. We have the wood walls here, which is would just be a continuation of what already exists, which would take a lot of logs, So, we, which means we've got to harvest trees. What else, what else do we have in here? So we have our stove. 
we'll place that here in just a moment. I'm just kind of seeing what else we could potentially smoke bomb. I need, I need borate. I wonder if that's a different rock we can harvest for that. That's interesting. Then we have like these iron things, small iron base. Which other buildings? Can, oh, that's kind of cool. But it needs cement. So that cement, I think, needs refining skill up to level 5 there, which is 9 points. But the reason I haven't you picked it is because I don't know if I want to do like more melee so I can get the Calibrite sword there for 9. You know, or is the ranged stuff good enough, right? You know, can, should I get the rifle? Which I, should, I will. So now there's a, there's a rifle. And the next level up will be sniper rifle. Then we get into the beam technology. So let's kind of see what else we have. Oh, there's a set line gloves. Which we need the hides from them. Set line hide boots. Oh, that's interesting. Do I have any set line hides? I thought we harvested those. Or maybe I'm not harvesting them correctly, but I thought you just equipped the knife. Unless we have to kill enough of them. Maybe we're not killing enough. We got the Rokars, the Lurker, Lilac, Samir, Pratness Pods. Their stone counterparts. Uh, yeah, I'm just kind of looking at what the descriptions are saying. That's interesting. Okay. Small crate. We want to create this. We need glue, six glue. How do we create six glue? Well, if you remember, it's right here. And we need resin, so we need more animal fat. So it's definitely not in the realm of possibility here because we need six. So that means we need 12. 12 animal fat at least. Oh man, that's just brutal. Brutal. <laughs> I do want to build the better armor as well. That is something I do want to do. And supply station. It uses to create a supply station. I wonder what that means. Which needs glass and cement. Which is probably higher refining skill. See, glass is level 7. Cement level 5. Okay, well, what about f fuel containment? For flamethrowers. That's cool. Rifle. So we need more calibrite. And resin. Oh, actually, we might be able to create this. So let's take a quick peek at our resin, which is up here. So we need, what do we need? We need three of those resins. So, and we need more calibrite. Oh, this should be easy. One, two, I think. We create three resins. So let's actually grab, um, what is it that I need for the, the gun? Let's pick ranged. Rifle. Uh, we need more calibrate. That's actually very easy. That's just a rock. Okay, let's go this way. Because there used to be these lurkers around here. Yeah, they're still there. We can see them in the distance. I don't know if I want to handle those right now. Here's some rocks. If there's any lurkers, we'll take them out. Otherwise, we will harvest these two stones. These stones are plenty. So, what do we need? Four better mining tools. I didn't see that. Is that under survival? Sharpen stick, painkillers. See better healing even. Snare trap, Tesla trap, set line hide cap, nano fiber gloves and boots, set line hide armor. So we need to actually level five to get the set line, which is those those kind of weird looking cat people stuff. <laughs> I'm just kind of looking through these quickly. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where to find that item. Um, steel knife, axe, sword. So we do have to see. So we have to increase everything like electrical wire, battery flash, computer, industrial station turret, portable shield, medical bot. That's kind of cool. Those things would be useful. Uh, I don't see. Oh, and we should have placed the stove. That's okay, so let's continue harvesting. Let's see how big this rock is. Yeah, boy, lots of fun. Lots of fun. We didn't get what we needed. We need Calibrate, right? And so, we need at least two of them, I think. Oh, come on, why is it... Come on, folks. There's some rocks back there. Let's kind of go harvest these. There's those little tiny ones. Those tiny rocks will have things like rhyolite 
um, and other interesting components. I wonder if this is because I'm near the starting areas. This makes you wonder if this is... No, no, see this rock is bigger. Lots of flint for ammo, which is good. Whoa! 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 Oh, you bastards! Like, shit, it's so stupid. Like, I find the combat very... I don't know, it's clunky. I find the game clunky in its respect. I think if you wanted to play a game that's not as clunky, just play Ark. I think. Because I just find this game just clunky. It's just, it's not very responsive to my controls. It's, it's being a real pain. Hey dudes! Come on! I didn't heal myself. Brutal! What the hell? Really pissing me off now. Let's do this. Let's run again. Come on, bastards. They just appear out of nowhere, it seems. Come on. Come on. See where I died. Hey, dumbasses. You let me mine? This is retarded, man. Died over and over and over. Now, where are they? Alright, I want to kill them. <laughs> I'm glad you don't lose anything, because that would be brutal if you lost stuff just due to the silly. A nature of the game. I just, I hate that. That really bugs me. But that's early access. That's what you get, right? You get something that might not be 100%. You might be paying for the software as is. And so that's why when it comes to all this stuff, if you're looking at buying one of these early access games, always make sure that when you purchase it, you realize that that's what you're purchasing is the game in that state. Right, with the possibility of it changing down the road, but again, it all depends on how far people go with their game, and you know the whole early access thing is is kind of interesting. But on the same note, I don't know. The only reason I pick games up in early access is because typically the games are cheaper, they're not as as expensive, and yeah, and so then I'm I'm just able to to purchase the game when normally I wouldn't be able to. So that's why I, I'm into early access. It's, plus, I like to play these kind of games ahead of the time, ahead of the curve. I like to try them out, see if they're actually going to be any good or not, um, all that kind of fun stuff. So I'm just going to kind of pick up some more logs here because we do use those. And stamina. For some reason, the stamina is really being, you know, like slayed, and I don't know if I like that. I'm eating, I'm drinking, I have everything as I think I should. So, I don't know, I just find it it goes down a lot faster now than what it used to. I know they've been, yeah, I know they've, there might have been a couple patches to the game, so that could be maybe my weight, maybe I'm kind of getting full on capacity. Where are we? Is there capacity? I don't think there is. I don't think that even is a thing. Let's kind of harvest this rock as well, and then we'll place that stove, and then I think call it an, an episode. So hopefully you've enjoyed it. Hopefully, <laughs> you know, all I really did was run around harvesting, and well, this is the reality of the game. This is what you'll be doing most of the time: is running around harvesting, whether it's slaying creatures or or not. So let's build this stove here. Since we've established that we need that, what's this? Oh yeah, the resin to build the the, the knife. Oh, the stove is tiny. Okay, well we can build that inside here. Right beside this thing. Right? Right. <laughs> so that way we can use... Ah, oh, come on, open the door. So that way we can use this. I didn't realize the stove would be so tiny. I thought it was going to be like a big thing like this thing. So that's kind of interesting. So now with the stove... Okay, so we need to make the resin anyway, so that's for sure. So we'll make the rifle. 
exceptional rifle. Oh, that's cool. I do want to create one of these crates. Shoot. How about a foot locker? Do I think we can create a foot locker. I know we were going to call this an episode, but I just kind of want to see what we can do with our storage situation. Because I want to kind of store some stuff at the base here. I want to create foot locker, so I would need more glue. I think glue requires animal fat, I think, and resin. So yeah, that's out of my reach at the moment, that means, which means I'll have to do some harvesting. So let us try out this new gun that we have. Where are we? This one. Exceptional rifle. So where do we want to replace? Well, the pistol's useless, so let's replace the pistol slot. And we can actually potentially get rid of this pistol. And that's why I want storage solutions, right? So let's see what this gun looks like. It looks just like the shotgun, unfortunately. Now, no animation when you're in this mode. Let's see? Let's zoom it around. There you go, folks. There's the rifle. It looks a lot like the shotgun. Let's see how this thing f fires. Uh, it aims pretty crappy. Um, it's like... Okay. It has more capacity. Let's just give it a shot here, and then we're done. Let's see here. Because the video should be around 20 minutes now. Okay. So if we shoot that guy... Doesn't do much damage. I don't know if I like it. Now where the where is he going? Like I don't understand the AI. I don't like the sway. So to get rid of the sway, you just don't aim. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this w w w this weapon is okay. It's just like the pistol, but it's a larger range, right? Yeah. What the what the hell? Woo! Woo! Okay, folks. There you go, bastards. Okay, let's harvest these. I'll cook lurker meat. I'll cook lurker meat. Do I need like an axe? I don't think I need an axe. That's where I thought we got the lurker hides before. Or maybe there's just lurker meat off of them. Okay, so this gun will be a lot better. So it replaces the pistol effectively. But we can't really aim because it does that stupid sway. Which makes it super difficult to shoot them. So let's equip this axe just in case. Where's the body? Here it is. You've skinned a lurker skin. Ah, so do I need to use the appropriate tool? That is interesting. So I wonder if we need to use axes instead of the knife. Maybe the knife is an early rudimentary way of harvesting, but yeah, anyways, we'll figure that out in the next episode. Maybe we'll focus on, on harvesting the animal fat and maybe some skins. Maybe try the set laying stuff on the other side there. Maybe we'll be able to find something with that. So yeah, so hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. Hopefully it was interesting. Otherwise, if not, well, this is how I discovered the game. It's just there's a lot of grinding, so uh, you'd be warned. <laughs> so thank you everybody for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Bye bye.